Hey, how's it going, guys? This is Dean with Taking Action. Today, we're gonna unbox this brand new Xiaomi Max 2. The original Mi Max was incredibly successful. It sold over 3 million units. The massive 6.4 inch display with a whopping battery that has 19 days standby time. But it's this Xiaomi Max 2, on top of all that, has even more to offer. So, let's have a look at it. The box still owes it to simplicity, and when you pop it open, you will see the phone itself covered in plastic. Beneath the tray, you have all the paperwork with a SIM card tool on the other side. With the original Mi Max, Xiaomi provides a micro USB cable and a 12 watt charger, but now you have a USB Type C charging cable and a redesigned 18 watt QC 3.0 charger that allows you to charge 68% in one hour, which is way faster than its predecessor. Mi Max 2 brings a new look to the table, all the rough edges has been softened, more curves are introduced to the design, which makes operating much easier. Given the size of the phone, this is the update we are happy to see. At the front, the sensors and selfie cameras are on two sides of the earpiece, which also works as a speaker. Under the screen, from left to right, you have menu key, home key, and back key, which aren't customizable. At the back, it has a typical iPhone look. The antenna lines blend well in the metal unibody. The back panel has a slight curve to the edge to provide a better hand feel, where you also have the camera module, a dual-tone flashlight, and a circular fingerprint scanner. Going around the sides, on top there's a headphone jack, thank goodness, a noise cancelling mic, and the infrared sensor. At the bottom, you have a microphone, USB Type-C port, and another speaker. On the left, there are two SIM card slots with one supporting up to 128GB external storage, and then you have the volume rocker and power button on the other side. This is a 6.44 inch 1080p IPS display. Gaming and watching videos is a pleasure on such a big screen. Compared to the original Mi Max, those black bars shrink from my numbingly hideous to, well, it doesn't bother me anymore. I haven't looked into detail yet, but I did notice the viewing angle isn't that great. Mi Max 2 was rumored to show up with Qualcomm's new high end 660 processor, which is widely expected since the original Mi Max has Snapdragon 650. Uh, later on, I was a little bit disappointed to find out it only has Snapdragon 625, which has less horsepower. But is it really a bad thing? Not exactly. 625 is produced using 14 nanometer manufacturing process compared to the 28 nanometer with 650. Uh, it has one of the lowest battery consumption and good enough performance. It breezes through all the games I play without any lags. Remember the time when 5000 is the capacity for power banks? Mi Max 2 has 5300 million power battery. With nearly 500 million more than its predecessor, it only adds a few grams to the weight. Camera is another big update. The rear camera has the same IMX386 sensor as Xiaomi Mi 6. It might just have the best camera for its price range. Compared to the original Mi Max, Mi Max 2 has better hand feel, even larger battery, better camera, USB Type-C port, metal unibody, and stereo speakers. Uh, I'm glad to see Xiaomi is heading the direction where it's more about user experience instead of just specs on paper. So what do you think of the changes Xiaomi has made? Leave a comment down below. Also, if you're interested in this phone, stay close to the channel. More videos are on the way. So that was it for today. I'll see you next time.